This is the process shot. I'm Michael. I'm stuck in a haunted movie theater, and I've seen Hand in Hand, a short German surrealist comedy film from Ennio Rochetti made back in 2019. It's actually so short that this review will probably be longer than the actual film. Anyways, it starts off with two politicians begrudgingly signing some kind of agreement at a press conference. They come face to face to shake hands, but both have a strong desire to take the upper hand. It's a struggle that soon grows into a horror when the men suddenly find themselves locked in a monstrous web of arms and hands, clawing at the other and soon consuming those in attendance. Nothing seems to be able to stop this black hole of chaos except for a lowly janitor who had been sitting by the sidelines of the conference. Again, this is such a short short that you can probably guess how it ends from there. That said, what we get really isn't all that bad, making a good use of its time to get everything it needs to across to the viewer. This is especially helped by the exaggerated performances of the characters, who remain mostly silent throughout, but are still able to put forth the right amount of emotional display and gestures to make things clear, as well as the overall editing of the film, which gives it a very fast pacing that accents the ongoing chaos and confusion. Cinematography is also helpful here, thanks to how clustered the actual environment is, and how quickly panic descends when things get crazy. I really don't have all that much to say because of how quickly everything is wrapped up, while still being able to feel like a complete story. The comedic focus of the situation keeps things from feeling tonally imbalanced, the characters are only as deep as they need to be, and the technical production here is on point, from the visual style to the digital effects work. Overall, I'd say that despite its length, Hand in Hand is a great short that gets its job done in due time. Hand in Hand, Ennio Ruschetti, 2019. Four and a half stars. I'd definitely recommend watching it if I were you. Anyways, that's it for me. If you like this review, leave it a like. If you didn't, leave a comment. Subscribe to the channel for more reviews in the future. And time. Well, if you are keeping track, it's time. I uh, didn't think to time it myself, so I don't actually know if this is longer or shorter. Ah oh, well.